I wish to also mention that this disconnect that's happening in people is a huge part of why people are such sheep because people are told not to follow the instinct it needs you cannot sleep as long as you need to you cannot do this you cannot do that and i am a firm believer in really um just let me first say <coughs> if anything i also have lived in a lot of different places and i've been to a lot of places and I see always common denominators. I'm not interested in um, what's different. Because I grew up seeing those countries on TV. So I knew things were different in different places. What I'm interested in is always the common denominators. And I've mentioned to you before, it doesn't matter if it's Costa Rica, Philippines, Indonesia, whatever the country may be, or Oh, well, I haven't been to the Philippines, actually, not yet. Let's say Croatia or in everywhere I go. Before I knew about Rh negative blood, I always met people who were so much like me or whom I just connected with. Like we knew each other, right? I can be in uh, wherever I may be, Nicaragua doesn't matter and suddenly wow there's somebody I just you know everybody is sort of set in the mindset of the region and the time right I talk about the timeless look and by look I don't mean nose ears eyes I mean sort of the face like what do I feel when I look at the person the aura the energy right so when you look at the <clears throat> 1920s video movie you see sort of people had a very different mindset of course at the time and communication was slower people had to make appointments people had to it was just a whole different state of mind and i never agree with anybody who blames technology on anything i think that is the most ridiculous thing period i have noticed people in my childhood who refused to go with the times and thought they were very clever clever about not having a vcr stupid right i remember when the internet came along some people said the internet doesn't work the internet i mean people uh, or they actually said it would be a one uh like a one day fly uh, within a couple of years nobody will use the internet anymore people don't like it i mean people make the stupidest of statements and that's the the best thing you can do is really really shut your ears and distance yourself from people seriously because otherwise i mean your ears will ring your head will ring your mind will be occupied with nonsense that's not what you want that's not what we want that is the worst thing that can happen when we are actually um due to vicinity occupy our thoughts with unnecessary things